In this video, I'm gonna show you how anybody just getting started in detailing can make their first thousand dollars. I've got four ways for you to do it. Let's get into it. All right, the first tactic is pretty obvious. It's friends and family. I would send out a group text or, or individual text um, to any friends and family you know that might be looking for detailing. But if they're not looking for it, ask them if they know anybody who might be interested. Um, obviously, I'd give them a discount to get them in, um, get some details under your belt, get some reviews. Um, but yeah, definitely start with friends and family first. That's kind of low hanging fruit. That's where everybody starts. Um, and you'd be surprised. You're going to get a couple of friends and family who are going to help you out, whether they need a detail or not. After you, after you contact your friends and family, uh, I'd start posting on social media. You can post on your personal socials on, you know, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, whatever you use, probably all of them. Um, I would do that, you know, once, maybe twice when you're first getting started, just to let, nope, just to let people know this is what you're doing now. Um, you're, you're doing detailing. If you need some, think of me. Also, you can make social medias for your business, um, business accounts on all the major ones. We use Instagram, YouTube, TikTok, Twitter, and Facebook, um, and we post on them every day. And I'd recommend doing that as well. It's a little time consuming at the beginning to make the content for social media, but once you make it, we make it in big batches for months at a time, then you can schedule it. We use a, a website called later.com and it schedules out all our, our, it schedules out all of our social media posts um, for months in advance, but that's free marketing as well. So you can get in front of hundreds and thousands of people in your area um, on social media for completely free. So I'd start doing that. Next, Facebook groups. I would go through, look for Facebook groups um, like neighborhood Facebook groups. There's buy, sell, trade groups in your area. Uh, what's happening in groups. So like what's happening in and then your city name. Um, they also have like suburbs for those. What's happening in your suburb. Facebook groups, and there's a bunch of bunch of Facebook groups. You can find dozens of Facebook groups um, all around your city. Uh, you can go in like car enthusiasts, um, Facebook groups in your area as well. Uh, it's also free, right? Most of these are all free because when you're starting off trying to make your first thousand, it doesn't make sense to, you know, blow 500 on ads um, just to make 500 bucks. You want to make free thousand. You want to make your first money for free or really cheap, and then you can reinvest those profits um, in your business and on advertising and get more and more customers that way. The last one is actually the one I started with. It's not what I would start with now, but it's flyers. So I'd print out a bunch of flyers. You can get them in the eight by 11, um, like normal size paper. And then you can shop them into quarters. So make them where there's four on each page. And then you can put them in on mailboxes, tape them on mailboxes. Um, you could also go into big parking lots and put them in uh, wiper blades. Um, you know, you can do this as many times as you want. It will get you customers. It's also really time consuming. So it's the most hands-on uh, boots on the ground approach. It will result in some jobs. So, you know, if you want to make that first thousand so you can start buying some Facebook ads, sorry, not Facebook ads, Google ads. Um, I don't recommend Facebook ads, especially when you're first getting started. Um, they're good for ceramic coatings, but they're not, they're not very good for just typical detailing. But the flyers work, all this stuff works, but the flyers definitely works. If you want to try everything, I'd give it a try. I'd start with the other stuff just because you can do it from home and it's more scalable. Um, but all this stuff should be getting you bookings on your calendar, right? You're gonna get you know your first thousand dollars, your first you know 10 customers, hopefully more. Um, and then you're gonna reinvest those profits in some kind of Google ads or something more scalable, but you're gonna make sure to get reviews from every one of these customers on your Google My Business profile, that's another free way to get leads. But it takes a little bit of traction, a little bit of time to start getting leads from Google. And the biggest way is to get reviews. So all these customers you should be funneling to your Google My Business page, um, having them leave a review. And then that in turn will end up giving you more free customers and it works in a big wheel. So you use this free marketing to get bookings on your calendar for free, get them to leave a review on your Google, account, on your Google My Business page, and then your Google Business page will funnel more free into your business, more free leads into your business rather. And then it, it kind of works in a flywheel that way. Eventually you just stop doing all the free stuff. Just you do Google ads, um, you know, nurture campaigns, email campaigns and text campaigns and your Google business pages and SEO. And it'll just start flywheeling that way and start organically growing. Um, but this is how I'd recommend any beginner start um, with this free marketing, get that, get the bookings in, get them to relieve a review. The reviews will in turn get you more business and then it works like that way in a big circle. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions, just leave a comment below. I read them all. Um, thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one.